Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's gonna to be a really quick video and we're gonna be going over how to edit pre-existing blocks. So we've gone over how to create blocks, we've gone over how to delete blocks. Today we're gonna to look at how to edit the block if you don't wanna delete it, but you don't wanna create a new one. Before we get into the video though, please consider subscribing to the channel. If you think the video is helpful or you find it helpful, give it a like down below. If you think someone else can find it helpful, give it a share. And if you wanna see anything else in AutoCAD, leave it in the comment section below. All right, so as I said in the intro, we're gonna learn how to edit blocks within AutoCAD. Again, this is gonna be super easy and super simple. The first thing you're gonna do is identify the block that you want to edit. So we're gonna come up here to the block and we're going to insert, and we're gonna edit the square block. Now the square block's the only one I have in this drawing, but again, this is just an example to make it simple and easy. So we're gonna click here, and as you can see, what I wanna do is I wanna edit this from a square to a triangle. So. What I'm gonna do is come up to the edit button in the block box underneath the home tab. We're gonna left click, and I'm gonna click edit up here. It's gonna bring down this edit block definition box. And as you can see here, we have square. We're gonna left click on square. Then we're gonna click okay. Now when we do that, it brings us to our block editor page. And this is where we have our um, action parameters that are available to kind of uh, make a block dynamic but we can also just edit blocks in this page as well. So what we're gonna do is we wanna change this square into a triangle. Now we're gonna come up here to the insert button, excuse me, the home tab button, and we're gonna go to the line button. Now when you're in the block editor, it's going to originally take you to this block editor button, but then you can just slide over like you're in regular AutoCAD and just do any sort of drawing that you want to. So since we want to make it a triangle, we're gonna come down here to this point right here. We're gonna bring this up right here and come down here and then we're going to escape and then what we're going to do is we're just going to trim off the edges right here right here right here and right here and as you can see here i have now created a triangle now we're not done quite yet what we're going to do is press escape we're going to come up here to the close block editor button we're going to left hand click and it's going to give us this uh, dialog box that pops up to confirm that we're making these changes so you can either discard the changes or you can save the changes and we're gonna save the changes. We're gonna left click. And as you can see here, it is now a triangle. Now, I brought the square into the drawing itself to show you that when you make that change, it will also update all of the blocks within the drawing. So if you're going to make an, a change or edit a block, make sure that it's what you are comfortable seeing within your drawing as well. Now we're gonna come up here to insert. We're gonna click square and then we're gonna insert it. Now, it's a triangle, but the block name is still square. So what we're gonna to do to fix the block name is we are going to use the rename function, and we're just gonna type in rename on your keyboard. We're going to come here, and then it's gonna give us this dialog box for renaming. We're gonna come here to blocks. It's already pre-selected. We're gonna click square, click right here in the box underneath square, and this is the rename to button. We are going to rename it to triangle, and then click OK. And then when you come down here, you now can see that it is triangle in the block library instead of square. All right, so we're gonna wrap the video here. Again, super quick video. This is not that difficult on a basic level. This again, is just meant to be quick and easy. It's meant to give you an idea of how to do this if you're trying to make a quick change to a block. If you like the video, give it a like down below. Be sure to subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one.